Hello everyone, good morning. I hope you guys are all well. Well, me, I am happy. Because you know what? I have a good news. Well, lately, like for three weeks, I am, I have been like training really, really hard uh, practicing my um, kumite. I was practicing and then um, working out with my footwork, um, my stamina, my endurance, my, my, my speed, everything. So, um, I was actually doing that because I was notified by the sensei um, three weeks before the competition. It was a short notice and I know I'm not very good at um, my kobite. Luck was with me during that um, uh, qualification and we won! Yay! We won! For this vlog to uh, like share it with you how uh, great I felt. I was overwhelmed because it was unexpected. Honestly, I opened the curtain and I I felt like I'm in cold sweat. Literally cold sweat. So I wasn't really prepared for that and it was my first time again in a long years going for that kind of uh, competition. I wasn't really ready going for a big sports hall and crowd and watching and like really I was shocked and I really wanted to back out at the last minute. And so I took a deep breath. I took a deep breath and then walk in and say hello to everybody, greet everyone, and just try to lose that kind of feeling. And then I sweated out a little bit. I, I sort of warm up a little bit and then I felt better. And I focused to what I am going to do and what is the reason why I am there. So, we started, we started uh, warming up, like we watched the first competition because first it was all the other individual. By the way, I was in the team female uh, committee event, 18 years old and above. So that's my category. Okay, we had each other and also the support from our co karate guys, um, competitors, they were like supporting us non-stop. They were all really good. They were international competitions all who won the gold medal. They were the ones who just went to Myanmar, uh, no, no, it's not Myanmar, I'm sorry, Cambodia. They went to Cambodia. See good one, you will know. Yeah, you will see their footwork, you will see how confident they are, you see their speed, you will see their strength, you will see their, their technique. Oh my goodness, I mean, a feeling after I overcome it, I don't really care anymore. The, the thing that I said in my mind was I really need to do this because this is the reason why I said yes. Mm -hmm. 
into this competition. So I went in. You know what I felt really after the competition? You know what I felt? I told myself, and this is not just me, it's all of us. We told ourselves that we should do this really, really often and that we should take this seriously. But I love the experience, I was very happy, I had fun. It changed my whole perspective of meeting. It motivates me, it motivates me and it inspires me. And at my age, I was really happy that I could still do it. It was fun. It was fun, really. I, I had fun. And it like, it's like two days that I've been clinging to my medal. And like for the first time, I have a national medal. Female team committee winner. So we're in second place. Of course, the winner were really, they deserve it. They were really good. Excellent. That moment when I am in the middle of that competition, when I was like punching, kicking, working out on how to get scores, it didn't really matter to me that there are a lot of people watching. And I, that didn't really matter. What matters was I have to get a point, I have to get a point, I have to. At that point, I told myself, we have to get a medal, we have to get a medal. But at first, I was like, it's just an experience. I wasn't really thinking of getting a medal. And then, at that point, when we won the first um, uh, qualification, we won the, the qualification, it was like, oh, we have to go for it. We have to fight for it. We are here. We are here already. We won. So the aim was to just go through with the qualification and bronze maybe is fine. So these past three weeks, that I have been training, training, training really hard. We have a really great team. So first, Yuriko is younger, and she had a lot of experience, but she is really good on kata. She's a kata competition, she likes kata. Sensei chose us to like represent the association, so like, okay, let's just go for it. So uh, Yuriko and Mailing and me, so I have a really great team. And, the only unfortunate thing is, I didn't bring any friends with me, I didn't bring B with me, so I didn't have anyone to take a photo, to, to record these important details. Thank you so much for watching me and thank you so much for all the support all the time and always. Um, this is it for today's vlog, just sharing to you the good news uh, and the result of my uh, committed competition. Yes, see you again next time. Bye! Hindi ko alam kung ano itong price na nakuha ko. Medal and this. Ay, ano to? LED light? Uy, parang ano pa? Parang karun? Yung LED light? Oh, wow. Ano to? Puro ganito. Oo, oh, parang LED light, ah. Oh. Ay, ngawang pina naman tayo. Ang bomb. Ano ito yung sinasabi ni ano kanina, ni Ling? Parang light para sa room? Parang gano'n? Ay, ano ganyan? Lights, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yung nilalagay sa anong sinasabit na lights. Mm -hmm. Wow, grabe makabati. <laughs> Maraming baterya. Yay! This is my present from the competition. And of course, my bonus. Mm -hmm. Haya! I wasn't expecting any of this. Good Sabi ko lang, me. experience lang. Sabi ko, pag maka-bronze, okay na. Pero I have we have silver. Yay! Wow! But you're gold to me. Huh? You're gold to me. Okay. You're the wicky punch. So face. Sorry. Oh. And that's the score. Did you hurt someone? They hurt me too. That's committee. We hurt each other. For fun. Okay. <laughs> and I got medal. Congratulations, this lady. My friend. Yeah. Yeah.
first my first committee competition. Yeah, I'm very happy. Oh. <laughs> Happy for you. Ngayon nagpay uh, um na ano yung tawag nun? yung re yung reward ko sa kaka training ko. Train ako ng training. Yung mga pass na na vlog ko is all about my committee training and this is my reward. Yay! Deserve it. Deserve and deserve. Thank you so much. Bye.